Police in Brookfield say they believe they know who was responsible for a large July 4th explosion that rattled homes and broke windows in a Maisry neighborhood. It's a story that we first told you about last month. Now, Gina Cadigan tells us what charges the teenager is facing once they find him. Gina. Well, police have been looking for Lars Seuss since Friday, but have not been able to arrest him yet. They believe he's the one that bought hundreds of dollars of fireworks and set them off just before a massive explosion in the neighborhood. People living on Bud Street in Maisry still have broken windows more than a month after a firework explosion. People could have got hurt if had I been in my bed in my room that night, I would have been showered with glass. It went 12 foot across my room. Police say on the 4th of July, 19 year old Lars Seuss put multiple different kinds of fireworks into a fire pit in this backyard. Investigators believe Seuss shot at the fireworks, causing this explosion that was caught on a neighbor's ring camera. A loud flash fell right in our chest, and then the percussion like knocked everything off our bedroom walls and, and our living room wall. Investigators say Seuss was seen on security video buying $400 worth of fireworks. Neighbors say they've gotten into confrontations with the family before. We don't get along with them too well. Okay. The neighborhood doesn't try to avoid all interactions. Police have charged Seuss with six counts of criminal damage, which won't carry any jail time. Some neighbors want to be fully paid back the hundreds of dollars it takes to fix their windows and more. I expect an apology. I'd like to see the kid get charged with something else other than the damage and the criminal damage. And you can't do this in a residential neighborhood. With more local news, I'm Gina Cadigan.